Hi, I'm Nick, and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having a great week. For those who just discovered me, thanks for stopping by. If you love all things Halo, Pokemon, and vlogs, you found the right channel. For today's newest episode, we will be looking at the newest Pokemon news regarding the next games that the Pokemon Company and Nintendo will release, Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl, and Pokemon Legends Arceus. Let's jump in. So right off the bat, we have confirmed, yes, confirmed release dates by the Pokemon Company for the newest installments. Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl will hit retail stores on the 19th of November this year, and Pokemon Legends will come out January 28th next year. Now I've got to figure out what to play first, the new Pokemon games or Halo Infinite? We also get a first look at the official cover art for the games. Now, some people are mixed with the cover art, with some saying that they would prefer the traditional Ken Sugimori covers the old Pokemon games did. And I won't lie, I feel the same way too. I would have preferred that style more. But these new covers for the games aren't at all bad. I love the detailing they put on Dialga and Palkia, the metallic material on Dialga's backplates and the skin textures they gave it look awesome. I mean, look at that chin! Also as well, they look like they're screaming really loudly. Now, now Palkia's design in a newer cover intrigues me the most, because while it does look as detailed as Dialga's model, a lot of the fans noticed Palkia is looking a bit fuzzy. And by bit, I mean a lot. Like the skin texture does have that, I guess you could say it does have that velvety look. But Palkia, as we all know, is not a fuzzy creature. It has skin like the alga, but then again, when I look at the alga, it does have that fuzzy look like Palkia as well, but not as prevalent. But at the end of the day, fuzzy or not, these models are nicely done and I like them. Another game cover we see as well is the very anticipated release on the Switch, Pokemon Legends Arceus, and in this one, it does use the Kensuke Mori art style, which I very much like. It has the two player trainers on the front with several Pokemon at the back looking straight ahead at Mount Coronet with something on the top that is glowing a little. Could possibly be Arceus, or it could just be Spear Pillar. It gives me Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild vibes. Actually, come to think of it, there are some similarities with these new Pokemon games and the Legend of Zelda. Hmm, something to think about I guess. And if you're indecisive about which version you want to get, Worry no further, because they also announced a dual pack that has both Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl. And not gonna lie, the cover for that is easily my favourite out of both Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl's game covers. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you love it, leave a like, and if you like my content and want to see more, Hit that subscribe button and bell button down below, it's the best way of being notified of my latest video. And I hope to see you in the next video. This is Attendo, signing out.